Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civ 5 as Ethiopia. Cool, so we last left off, we were at peace, and the plan was to take out the Aztecs. Now? We're at war? I don't remember, was I gonna go to war, like, right now? It definitely wouldn't have hurt. Well, this is awkward. No, I think I was going to wait until I got all my carriers and got my ships uh, set. Right, we got those guys going for the oil. Where are the carriers? Oh, there they are. Right, so in a couple more turns. <clears throat> I believe I was going to try to rush their citadel. And the good news is they are a soldier tech below me. So we should get it. Um, I'm going to wait at least one more turn. I want my happiness to increase. Uh, what else? Yeah, pretty much just wipe them out. Then I'll probably just uh, plant cities on the rest of our continent. Because there's actually a decent amount of area. That has yet to be settled. And that'll be good for resources and stuff. my three really really good guys we should be set the artillery they can fire twice so they're basically just way more effective so hopefully it doesn't call me on it because that would suck because I want to take out all the ships in one go um you just move to here Wait, you stay there. Okay. Just taking a look at his current ships. Not worried in the slightest. Okay, next turn. I will definitely be ready by then. So the first thing we'll go after are stronger units, of course. Though I may consider just trying to take this city with everything. But I'm going to probably use my bombers against these guys. What? What happened? Why did I let, why did I let that happen? We're not getting a luxury resource? I don't know if it's one we already had. Hold on. Hold the phone. Golden Age, built a great firewall, no one's gonna wor have to worry about people stealing techs. So, we're gonna move him out, because there's absolutely no point in me having him in my capital anymore. And you're going to send him to... Singapore. Why not? Trying to can I coup anywhere? Geneva, 21% chance, not good enough. I guess I could try in five turns. Um, where was it? Why is that running? Oh well, whatever. Um, Jakarta. No real quests that I can do. I have enough gold to give them influence though. Okay, and my capital is done. And I'll build a castle. We need to get castles everywhere. They don't cost anything. Give me extra resources. Okay. Chicota. Remember people telling me that I just had to be in their borders to do that? No, that's not the case. What are you guys, what are you guys watching? Uh, intercept. And I'm gonna... Actually, I'm gonna see how large the range of bombers are. Large. Okay, that's good. 
Um, I have you up here. You. Not that it really matters. I don't see he has any aircraft. Now or never? That's the question. And I first for the first time that I've seen. And if I mispronounce this, which 99% chance I will. Nuschwanstein, Stein, Storm, whatever. I don't know. So, um, yeah, it's the first time I've actually seen it. That's just, I find that interesting. Because I thought that Wonder was the one who could be built. Although it could be because I loaded the game back and I just haven't noticed. Anywho. We're going to focus on growth. And we have 399 gold per turn. Incredible. So the good news is if I take this, because I'll be able to run this guy straight into it. If I take this, I won't have to worry about anything ranging my units. I'm assuming. I'm not 100% on that. The city can't hit me. He doesn't appear to have any real ranged units. I think I'm ready. Let's see what he says. Yeah, I don't really like attacking my friends. Especially because the Inca really don't like me. Um, it makes me a little bit... Oh, that's... I have a freaking army over here. Derp. Um, let's wait one more turn then. I really don't want him to call out on me. I think he will too. I would not be surprised. You know what? I'm ready to move. We're gonna do that. You need to upgrade. Two guys need to upgrade. Three guys need to upgrade down here. Four guys need to upgrade down here. Five, six. Wait, I need to upgrade like everybody down here. Okay. We can hold off that assault. These guys can just hold that side, I guess. Yes, war. You're one to talk. Gems to gold to pearls from. So we're going to lose a little bit of happiness, but that's okay. Range. Missile through the land. Yep. Not a chance. You can just alert. Um, actually, you're a tank. You are a freaking tank. That's actually a city I really want down there for all that salt. But anyway. We are going to take this city. Purely with, uh... Ships and aircraft. And etc. 22. They're gonna level up relatively soon, which is good. Hopefully I can take this guy with just bombers. Which it looks like I'll be able to. And the one thing I really do like that they included, at least in the expansion, was the fluidity of battle. Even though these things take a long time, I can queue them up. And it'll actually show me uh, what's happening beforehand, which is good. Because before, you'd have to do one at a time and wait until it finished. But it does the calculations beforehand. Okay. Take a look. Right, we, we get a free broadcast tower. Um, the city is really not all that appealing, except it does have access to the. Bit. No, so does the capital. You have access to this uranium. The only real benefit is this, which the city has. has. Um, we're gonna raise this city. Okay, and I still have aircraft, um, which we will use 
you're gonna move over here and the reason I'm moving this guy is to help um, control in case he has any uh, aircraft that he wants to attack me with which I do not believe to be the case but anyway we're at, we have battleships which will definitely weaken these two ships we can uh, finish them off with melee ships maybe we can take them and if we don't it's not a huge deal Not too surprising there. You got nothing. We have two bombers that we shall use to weaken units. Have you rushed the citadel? So Theoretically, because I'm not sure how this works, I should be in absolutely no danger from being ranged. Theoretically. Why am I only at 124 gold? What happened? Oh, raising this, attacking the city. That's probably what happened. I'm wondering, like, I don't need to upgrade units and stuff, and why do I- I didn't do that, so why do I have money? It's still the same turn! Yeah, we need more money before I can upgrade anybody, I'm pretty sure. Which is fine, we're getting a lot of money per turn. Um, uh, hmm... I do not like this as much, but I'll do it anyway. Twice. It did! Nice! I love the... That works. And this is also impassable terrain, which actually makes this a really good defensive location that was actually not too bad. From a strategic standpoint. I'm just way too good. Just have you wait here. My tank took how much damage? Okay, well, you can move back to the city and just heal up real quickly. Um, move up here, protect that flank, you move back here. That artillery can move up, I'll have a guy come over here. I'll probably destroy whatever it's, comes over here with ships. Oh, right, we can attack his capital with ships. That's definitely something I can do. I'll just keep on using my ships to do that. And just use my military to take out everything else. Yeah, you have you can't fire or anything. And you are out of units. Sounds good. Let's see his retaliation. Which I expect will to be really weak, especially considering I put myself in a position that I'm not really too worried about getting attacked. That was a really fast sentence. I'm in, I just impressed myself. Still have three conversions left. I don't want to convert anyone else yet. I don't want to piss off anyone anymore than I probably already have with all this war over there. But the plan is, because this game's going so well, the plan is to take over my continent and then possibly go for a domination victory. Because I have so many cities that are just pumping out units as fast as I want. I have plenty of resources. The only downside I can see right now at the moment is happiness, which I can reset. And we may actually get into late game warfare, which has only happened once. Um, that I can recall. Okay, this is kind of expected. Expected some kind of counterattack. They want their workers. You're sorry. By the way, you're next. So one nice thing about having as good a computer as me is that I can actually wage all this war and not take forever. For those of you who don't know, who've only been following me since my uh, Gods and Kings, I played... Um, I'm not sure, actually. Possibly all 30... 
of my uh, Let's Plays of Justice if I'm on my Mac PC and I was recording it uh, via software. So, for this game, what am I doing with it? Well, I happen to be recording externally and it happens to be about five times as good as my laptop, which, you know, that's what you get for a desktop computer, but whatever. Best two grand I ever spent. It's really cool though because actually for a project for my school right now, it's an it's a computer class that's basically how to use the computer, essentially. It's stupid, but it's required, so I have to do it. Um real quick, what am I gonna build here? Bombers. I wanna get level three bombers. What hit me? Oh what? What hit me? Hold the phone. <gasps> it did take damage! That's stupid! I have control of this area! Okay. Sure, fine, whatever. That just means I'm pissed. Hey, guess what? Blocked you. You come to here. You can just stay there, I guess. Actually, no. You move here. You move here. That's just stupid. Yeah, I want you to heal. You guys can't. Great generals can't heal, huh? Well, that sucks. Okay, well, I'm not too worried. Why am I not worried? There's no way I can lose this war. Unless I totally botch it on purpose. What's really cool is I basically have another uh, bunch of artillery units. Anyway, I need to find out where all of his ships went because I thought he had more than what I could take out. Uh, he does not appear to have any anti-aircraft, so I'm just going to go ahead and bomb him. Might not hurt to keep my my uh, carriers in my territory, actually, because then the uh, bombers that have air repair will heal more quickly. They don't appear to have any aircraft, so fighters will get involved now and help do a little bit of damage. I am overpowered. Sub, just explore a little bit. Yeah, good job over there. Rip and finish. Okay. Let's get three guys and get my artillery to move up. Go ahead and move all three of my artillery up. Yeah, you're gonna move back into my territory. You're going to run. I can upgrade this cavalry, actually. I should probably do that. Just go up there to protect. Oh, you upgraded into that kind of tank. That's right, I've never actually built one of those kinds of tanks. Okay, let's get... We need more melee ships. More destroyers. More destroyers. 
who have no real mission at the moment. You can move to here. You can move to here. You can move to there. She can't heal this turn anyway. I'm just moving on my ship so that he has no idea where they are. I keep on upgrading people. Dang, I had a lot of money. You can heal. Uh, you are going to move down this side. That's so stupid. I had control of that area. It should not be able to do damage to me. Oh well. It's not a war with any of the city-states anymore. I'll go for a diplomatic victory after I kill everyone else. It'd be kind of funny. Probably win that way, but I'm not going down that tech because I kind of want to get more militaristic. Got all this power. Why not, right? I'm not getting drunk with power. Not a chance. Where am I going next? To Colombo? Thank you. Took you a little while. Okay, and we have an extra artillery now. Stupid camera. Poco offero a te considerandum. Sure. None. Well, screw you then. I'm good with what I got. over here? No, I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, let's finish up patronage. Boom! Gotta love all of this culture. Now everyone else we laugh in their faces because we just dominate in every stat. Production, everything, we're just dominating. This is how it should be. Destroyer. Go automate. Where do you think you're going? Get back. You're doing, you retard. Apparently he's going sightseeing. what I would like to see. Now I have less to worry about. They've got enough room for range where it doesn't really matter. I do have to watch out though because I don't want them switching to uh, stealth bombers because they can't actually go on carriers which really bums me out. But it makes sense because stealth bombers are ridiculously powerful. So what I probably will do is send a bunch uh, if I do in fact decide to go across the uh, to the other continent, so I just start taking them out. I'll probably keep them as bombers until I actually take out the city. Now, 
have all my guys over here healing. So that's just no good. I can't have that many wounded people. Okay, and shortly I will begin my assault. I'll send everyone else. All my naval guys down here. Okay, let's do a little bit hit and run. These guys are barely taking any hits. You actually have nothing to do. Ha ha ha. All of this movement. My destroyer is in position. I'll just have you move back into those borders. Nice thing about having a mobile air mobile the units. Just do nothing, I'm not worried about that. Okay, interception one, interception two. What's in here? Good, it was a bomber. I think I have one more bomber. Yeah, okay. That'll be more than enough. Happiness is okay. do with you? That is a question. What to do with you? Hydro plant. Eh, yeah, museum. Probably should start building economic buildings shortly just to increase my overall revenue because more money is good. Okay. That city should start growing and producing decently now. Look at all the plus 20s and above. Now I can increase my production even more. <laughs> okay, and it's time to cut the video off. So, thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.